You might not be seeing it just yet, but the electric motorcycle takeover is underway. The number of new models with ever improving technical specifications nearly match those of the internal combustion counterparts. In this episode, we will be giving you the roundup of the latest models scheduled to enter the market by 2021, citing their electric range, speeds, and other important data. Support the electric revolution by subscribing to our channel, and let's get technical. Luna is a brainchild of the Brooklyn-based startup Terraform that was revealed in its production-ready form in July 2020. This two-wheeler has a completely modular design that allows different body work to be installed and battery capacity to be increased. As standard, it comes powered by a belt-driven 55-horsepower motor and a 10-kilowatt-hour pack, offering a maximum riding range of 120 miles. The bike gets three riding modes, and in the most performance oriented one, it can reach 90 miles per hour and accelerate to 60 in 3.8 seconds. Finally, the Luna is equipped with lots of premium components, like Olin suspension, proximity radars, and a 3.4 inch HD display. And it can be ordered in two body types, race and scrambler. Presented at the 2019 Milan Motorcycle Show, the Panther is an upcoming all-electric bike from the California-registered Hayden Motorcycles that will be manufactured at the company's plant in China. It has cruiser looks, boasts highway-capable speeds of 80 miles per hour, and is expected to cover up to 100 miles on a charge. The bike is brought in motion by a 61-horsepower motor and a Panasonic battery pack. It gets three riding modes that can be managed via a 7-inch smart display thanks to a long 65-inch wheelbase, a low seat, and wide handlebars. The Panther also offers relaxed ergonomics that should allow you to feel comfortable during longer trips. Its lightweight of just 132 pounds and super sleek profile may create an impression that the FRX1 is just a rugged mountain bicycle, but its motorcycle level specs prove the opposite. The bike features a 7000 series aluminum frame with mid-drive motor placement and an off-road adjustable suspension with 250 millimeters of travel both front and rear. The liquid coated brushless motor delivers 20 horsepower and has a peak torque of 260 pound feet at the rear wheel. The 2.2 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery has an estimated range of 62 miles and will need six hours to recharge from a domestic plug. The electric revolution is just beginning. Time to show your rebellious spirit by joining the zero emissions movement by liking this video and subscribing to our channel. Let's proceed. Get ready to welcome the world's most futuristic electric motorcycle by the end of 2020. Since the Finnish Verge is already collecting pre-order deposits for its hubless design superbike, previously known as the RMK E2, the rebranded two-wheeler keeps its powerful inner spirit delivering 107 horsepower and 738 pound-feet of torque to the rear wheel. These numbers will get you to 60 under 4 seconds. Despite its large battery pack that ensures carefree range of up to 188 miles, the Verge TS keeps its weight at acceptable 440 pounds. Preliminary announcements indicate that the sports bike will get Brembo brakes, high-spec suspension, and 45-minute DC fast charging capability.
Out from distant Australia, Fonzarelli is an award-winning manufacturer of electric scooters and bikes, established in 2010. The company's NKD is a compact and lightweight dual-sport motorcycle that is offered in four modifications. All powered by a mid-mounted brushless motor with belt drive that delivers from 11 to 16 horses depending on the model. The entry-level bike in the range is called NKDA. It offers 50 miles per hour speeds and 31 miles of range. The top NKDX model is 12 miles per hour faster, while its range is four times longer, reaching 124 miles on a charge. Designed and engineered in Germany, the Black Tea Moped boasts timeless 70 Scramblers exterior styling with characteristic round LED headlamp, old school tubular steel frame, and a flat black seat. The bike features a 6.7 horsepower rear hub electric motor, good enough for 132 pound feet of torque. With a Sabaton controller and a removable 1.7 kilowatt hour battery, the two wheeler is capable of 50 miles per hour top speeds and a maximum all electric range of 43 miles. As standard, the model is equipped with 18-inch wheels wrapped in all-weather tires, dual rear shocks, and hydraulic disc brakes. The Italian Vins Motors began as many successful businesses have, from a garage of its founder, a former Ferrari employee, Vincenzo Mattia. In three years on the market, the company developed several ICE motorcycles and in 2020 premiered its first all-electric prototype. The EV01 has sports bike styling with aggressive fairings and double LED headlights, and it is built on a carbon fiber monocoque chassis. The latter is fitted with a double A arm front and push rod rear suspension. The drivetrain tech comes from zero motorcycles, so the bike gets a 70 horsepower motor matted to the brand's latest 14 kilowatt hour battery pack. Nepal's first electric motorcycle has been developed by the Yatri Motorcycle Startup that was founded in 2017. The Project Zero was inspired by the looks of the 1960s cafe racers and follows the in-house developed elegance in motion design philosophy. The motorcycle offers 143 miles of range and is driven by a 40 horsepower motor. The startup prides itself on developing the Yatri Hub application that connects the 7-inch full HD dashboard to your smartphone. The first 50 production units of this e-bike will be built by the end of 2020, with a bunch of changes proposed by the test riders. Like higher ground clearance, improved ergonomics, and enhanced vehicle dynamics. The same engineer behind the electric conversion kit for the Honda Cub moped, Matthew Waddick is back with yet another impressive project. The new e-scrambler is being developed by the newly founded Switch Motorcycles Enterprise operated from Shanghai. The mid-sized two-wheeler rides on fat 18-inch KTM rims and is built over the CNC welded frame. The e-scrambler has a belt-driven mid-mounted 67 horsepower motor and is equipped with a large 11 kilowatt hour battery good for 94 miles. On its resume are 94 mile per hour top speed and 3.2 seconds 0 to 60 acceleration. Integrated Wi-Fi and GPS tracking 
standard ABS system, and USB charging ports. What are your thoughts about the presented electric vehicle lineup? Which one is your top pick? Answer these questions in the comments below and support the electric revolution by liking this video. By subscribing to the channel, you will always get notified about new EV videos. So smash that red button and ring the bell without hesitation. See you later.